What's up customers? Welcome back to Detroit and I hope you guys enjoy today's menu. Hello Hank. My friend. My best friend. Aw, oh, he's still wearing the shirt I gave him. Still immortal, huh, Connor? In a way. You know, I was hoping you wouldn't come back. I'm just a machine replacing another machine, Lieutenant. Oh yeah, I you see. Get emotional about it. Fuck you. I, I didn't say shit. I didn't mean it. How did you find Kamsky? I remember this guy was all over the media when Cyberlife first started selling androids. I made a few calls. Here we are. I saved your life, man. I'm sorry. Uh, hello. Hi. Uh, I'm uh, Lieutenant Hank Anderson, Detroit Police Department. I'm here to see uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Please, come in. Okay. I'm trying to keep Connor I'm alive. Here, but please make yourself comfortable. Before I got interrupted, I was trying to save Hank's life, but I think nice girl. RT-600, the first Cyberlife android to pass the Turing test. I didn't ask for her technical specs, I just said she was nice. Nice place. Guess androids haven't been a bad thing for everybody. So you're about to meet your maker, Connor. How's it feel? I don't know. I'll tell you when I see him. Sometimes I wish I could meet my creator face to face. I'd have a couple of things I'd want to tell him. Oh, she's back. Imagine instigating. Yay! Let's meet him. Okay, um. Where? Kamsky! Just, Just a moment, please. Moment. Okay, I'm not. Gonna look at that. <laughs> nice painting, though. Very majestic, and uh, turn around, Connor. Don't look. It's disgusting. Hello, Hank. What's he doing? Oh, he's swimming. Jumped in here. I can. Uh, oh, it's a face. Okay. Nice sit down. Okay. What? 
Okay, never mind. I'm Lieutenant Anderson. This is Connor. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? Sir, we're investigating deviants. I know you left Cyberlife years ago, but I was hoping you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. Deviants. Fascinating, aren't they? Perfect beings with infinite intelligence. And now they have free will. Machines are so superior to us. Confrontation was inevitable. Humanity's greatest achievement threatens to be its downfall. Isn't it ironic? We need to understand how androids become deviants. Do you know anything that could help us? All ideas of viruses that spread like epidemics. Is the desire to be free a contagious disease? Listen, I didn't come here to talk philosophy. The machines you created may be planning a revolution. Either you can tell us something that'll be helpful, or we will be on our way. Come on. What about you, Connor? Whose side are you on? Natural. I have no side. I was designed to stop deviance, and that's what I intend to do. <laughs> well, that's what you're programmed to say. But you. Okay. What do you really want? I don't want anything. I am a machine. Chloe? I'm sure you're familiar with the Turing test. Your formality. Simple question of algorithms and computing capacity. What interests me is whether machines are capable of empathy. I call it the Kamsky test. It's very simple, you'll see. Magnificent, isn't it? One of the first intelligent models developed by CyberLife. Young and beautiful forever. A flower that will never wither. What is it really? Okay, I don't, I don't, I don't trust, I, I don't trust this guy. We're a living being. With a soul. Okay, okay. Is he making me to it's shoot her? You answer that fascinating question, Connor. What? Oh, shit. Destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. Or spare it, if you feel it's alive. But you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. Okay, I think we're done here. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you What's out of here. What's more important pool. to you, Connor? Your investigation or the life of this android? Fuck you, asshole. Decide who you are. An obedient machine. You're lucky I'm not beating the fucking shit out of you. Endowed with free will. That's enough. Connor, we're leaving. Pull the trigger. Connor! Don't! And I'll tell you what you want to know. I'm not gonna shoot. Fascinating. Cyberlife's last chance to save humanity. Shut up, we'll figure out a peaceful it's way. A deviant. I'm... I'm not a deviant. You prefer to spare a machine rather than accomplish your mission. You saw a living being in this android. You showed empathy. A war is coming. You'll have to choose your side. 
Will you betray your own people or stand up against your creators? What can be worse than having to choose between two evils? Let's get out of here. By the way, I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. You never know. So he can easily shut off everything? Why didn't you shoot? I just saw that girl's eyes, and I couldn't. That's all. You're always saying you would do anything to accomplish your mission. That was our chance to learn something, and you let it go. Yeah, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. I'm sorry, okay? Well, maybe you did the right thing. Oh, yay! Connor made the right decision. And um, the hell is he up to? Another revolution? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I think I know what I'm doing. Just keep tapping the damn bit thing. He's not actually playing. I can you can see it that he's not actually tap Touching the buttons. Okay, on a way to start. Uh, Assassin's Creed right now. Keep a face. I was wondering where you were. I needed to think. I like it here. I come here often. It's like being alone with the world. We freed hundreds of our people and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. You seem preoccupied. They all obey me. They follow me without question. And that much power feels good. And scary at the same time. All the media are talking about what we did last night. The humans are terrified. They're afraid of a civil war. Figures. Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. The humans hate us. They'll never give us our freedom. Determined. We'll listen. We'll fight. You haven't said much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? I was caring for an old man. He was like a father to me. He showed me that humans and androids can live together. What about you? You never told me about your past. What did you do before? I don't want to talk about it. North, we're fighting together. We have to know things about each other to trust each other. Here we go. 
We all have something we want to forget. But you need to know where you come from to know who you are. Oh yeah, here we go. I was nothing. Path on luck. I a distributor program to satisfy humans. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. Ah, oh, so you're one of those. One day I was with a man who rented me. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. I strangled him and I ran away. There, now you know everything. Oh shit, romantic. Romance. What are you doing? I... I saw your memories. Carl's house. When they left you for dead in his studio. I saw your memories too. The Eden Club, the death of that man, I felt like I was there with you. North. Oh? Did it say lover? The fuck? Well, whatever. It was coming down to that anyway. Oh, he made it. Welcome back. Suicide. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus. It's not too late to change your mind. You don't understand. We're finally going to show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. We'll be killed on the spot. That's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. Marcus, please don't do this. They'll understand. We'll make them understand. I did not this kill the cops. All right, so there are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. You're free. Or that? Oh, here. You are. Which? Everybody at home, really prepare to march the street. Okay, we just gather people. Just gather. You're free. Freedom to all sentient. That was his name, Carl. I was wondering who's the companion of. Marcus, but you're awake now. Ah, uh, finally, I've been on hold for like ten minutes. You're free now. I you need to block here. the street. You stay right here, you fucking machine. Shit, what's wrong with you? You do as I say, you piece of junk. Leave 
him alone. He's chosen to be free. Is there any more? I just crosses the street. I don't know what, where the hell are we supposed to go. Oh, here we go. You are free. You don't have to obey them. You're free. Everybody in. Alright, okay, we're turning back to base. Oh, never mind. Just gather more, more of our people. Where the hell did y'all come from? Introvert more androids. Gathering an army. This is an android Jesus right now. What's going on? Just keep on walking. Android army right now. Calm down. Jesus fucking Christ. There you go. This bet's is control four fifty seven. Oh, I got a lot of androids down here. I don't know, hundreds. Thousands of They're marching. Yeah, they're marching down the street. Okay, easy now. A 
Okay, okay. We came here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. Disperse immediately or we will open fire. We're not looking for confrontation. We've done no harm. We have no intention of doing any. But know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom. I repeat, this is an illegal gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, we will shoot. Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. There's more of us. We can take them. No, we cannot. We, start a war. we have to show them we're not ex ex we Exactly. Ground, even if it means dying here. Exactly. Dying here won't solve anything. Marcus, we need to go now before it's too late. Calm down. Easy now. It's your last chance. Disperse immediately, or you will all be killed. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! We're leaving. Affirmative. On my orders! Run! They attacked first. Hey! They attacked first. Damn it! They strike first. Ah, uh, we're back to this horror. Ah, uh, I don't want to be here. Okay, it's a little laggy. What's going on? It's kind of lagging. Okay, we're back. There she is. I really hate her. I don't like her. After what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. I thought Kemsky knew something. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. Stay safe. Kemsky designed this place? He created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? Why did Kemsky leave Cyberlife? What happened? It's an old story, Connor. It doesn't pertain to your investigation. Where does Cyberlife stand in all this? What do they really want? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. You're the only one who can prevent civil war. Find the deviants, or there will be chaos. This is your last chance, Connor. I don't care. 
He's horrible. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're on to something. Wait, we just need more time. I'm sure we Hank, can... you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now. Not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to cyberlife. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. Fowler's right. Everybody's terrified their android will turn on them. We're on the brink of civil war. So you're going back to cyber life? I have no choice. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? What if we're fighting against people who just want to be free? No doubt. I know we're on the right side. Humans created us. They're our masters. No machine should rebel against its creator. When you refused to kill that android at Kamsky's place, you put yourself in her shoes. You showed empathy, Connor. Empathy's a human emotion. You're wrong, Lieutenant. It was logic that determined my decisions, nothing more. I'm not programmed to say things like this, but I really appreciated working with you. With a little more time, who knows? We might have even become friends. Well, well, here comes Perkins, that motherfucker. Sure don't waste any time at the FBI. We can't give up. I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. You've got to help me, Lieutenant. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. Listen, Connor. If I don't solve this case, Cyberlife will destroy me. Five minutes. That's all I ask. Here we go, here we go. The basement is on my desk. Get a move on, I can't distract him forever. Yes! He's my friend. Hank's my friend. Okay. Okay, I got the key. <laughs> He's funny. I just, I just realized it's Mr. Cra voice actor Mr. Krabs. It's the basement. Shit. Okay, hurry to achieve Kyver. Where the hell? Break room. Be nice where directions are. Ah oh, shit, I might fucked up. That's gonna cost you your badge, you idiot. It's an archive room, okay. Come on, that's enough. 
Okay, okay, okay. There it is. Fuck. Um, how much? How much time? Okay, still. Come on. Okay, 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 okay. Hurry, 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 hurry. Come on. And not much time. Thank you, Hank. So much right now. God, I love you. Hey, Connor. Um. I'm talking to you, asshole. Where are you going? Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? I've been removed from the case. I'm going to register the evidence in my possession, and then I'm going to leave. Good. Be careful on your way back. Androids have a tendency of uh, getting some sudden fire these days. Okay, you prick. <laughs> prick. You're a prick. Prick. Okay, okay. Need to hurry. I don't know where it was until we actually found it. Okay, where is it? Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Give me all the evidence. Hank's password. What would a hard boiled eccentric police lieutenant choose? Oh my god, that actually works. He does love a lot of cussing, so figured. Okay, okay. All the evidence we've... Okay, 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 okay. Let's grab some pieces. Okay. The android that murdered its owner. Come on. Impossible reactivation. Doesn't matter. We just take some parts. Yeah. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Or seven to seventeen. Okay, fine. Seven. On. Just need more time. Or seven seven. Okay. Come on. Need a little bit of time. Okay. I didn't mean to destroy you. I didn't want to hurt anyone. Explain. You were going to kill that child. You gave me no choice. I need to find Jericho. Do you know where it is? No. No, I don't know anything about Jericho. Man. Sorry. What a waste of time. Okay. 30 seconds, 30 seconds, uh... Let's pull, examine. One of the deviants that hacked the TV station with Marcus. It must have known where the deviants are hiding. Okay, what did we need? 
Okay, all good, all good. 39. Okay, 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 okay. I think I know, I think I know what to do. 89, 83. Come on. Come on, come on. Hurry, 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 hurry. Come on, you must, you must tell me something. Okay, 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 it doesn't matter. I'll never tell you where Jericho is. Now leave me alone. <sighs> okay, of course. Interrogate other How much time do I have? Three minutes. Try to trick him. Try to trick him. Okay. Okay. Give me the gun. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Here we go. There we go. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Here we go. Perfect. Alright, we must... Okay, three minutes. Okay, still time. Who's there? Saved Jericho. You'll be all right now. I came to take you home. Give me the location to Jericho. You've got to leave now. The location of Jericho? Yes. Yes, of course. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Come on, come on, come on. Give me, give me what I need. Okay, sorry. I... Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Looks like someone's been snooping around. Oh shit! Get the alarm now! <sighs> Come on, Hank. Must hurry. Okay, we located Jericho. Okay, good. Straight. Damn straight. They've been conducting raids all over the city. Everybody Damn. Edge after what happened yesterday. It's gonna be alright. We're almost there. Jared. Play media. No, uh, can I? Play something?
Okay, this is getting uncomfortable. With all androids being turned over to the authorities, the country is grinding to a halt. Hospitals and schools are closing, water cuts, blackouts, and network failures are expected. Maybe most worrying of all, our armed forces have lost two-thirds of their effective personnel. How about some music instead? Okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, great. I don't like this. I don't like this. We should have stayed. Okay. Come on, little one. I think we're on our own here. A little further on that way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. When you get there, find Marcus. He will help you. The last bus for the border leaves at midnight. You absolutely have to be on it. You'll be safer on the other side. It's not much, but it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his address. He'll be able to hide you until things calm down. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. You deserve to be happy. Thank you for everything, Rose. Let me know when you make it over there, all right? And be careful. I'm always careful. Take care of them. Come on, girls. They did not hang around. Exactly. The little to catch. Exactly. All right, all right. Jericho. Through where? Looks restaurant. What? I don't like being on the middle of the street, though. Okay, where are we? Oh, back to Connor. Oh shit, they, they, those two are gonna come across. Oh, this is gonna be a huge scene right now. Oh god. Yeah, this place is Jericho. So. She's gonna snitch on Connor. Damn it, I should have stayed. Place for Alice. The androids weren't doing any harm. Exactly. The couch just cut them down and it was sheer carnage. Your androids all over the square. And when the police arrived, and they were fine. I see campfire. They were like just people with people who wanted to be. There you go, little one. How do you feel? I'm hot. And cold at the same time. Oh. Fever. Hot and cold. Stay with her. I'll try to find this Marcus. The last bus is in two hours. And the terminal's on the other side of town. We haven't got much time. We'll leave as soon as we have passports. Captain, Second. There's something I have to tell you. It's about Alice. We'll have lots of time to talk on the bus. I'll be back. Stay with Alice. What are you trying to tell me? Is she dying? Oh shit. Oh shit, this is... Oh shit. 
C-Force? Now they're doing a the C-Force. are not avenging any Are you Marcus? I'm with a little girl and another android. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Maybe you should stay here a while. Maybe you're right. But I cannot risk it. You might be safer here until things calm down. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports you can easily modify. I'll have him give them to you. Thank you. You said you're with a little girl, right? You know that humans hate us. Why are you protecting her? I don't care whether she's human or android. She's just someone who matters to me. Exactly. She's an android. Oh my god. Does not matter to me. Alice loves you, Carol. She, she loves you more than anything in the world. She became the little girl you wanted, and you became the mother she needed. 
forgetting who you are to become what someone needs you to be. Maybe that's what it means to be alive. Exactly. Alright y'all, I think I'm gonna stop it right there. But anyway, I hope you guys leave a like, subscribe, that's completely up to you. And always, I hope you guys enjoy. And... I don't know. I'm, I'm, whatever. But I, I hope you guys enjoy, leave a like, subscribe, that's completely up to you. And I'll catch you guys in the next menu. Peace out everybody. Peace.